First create a new waveform file by clicking File, New. Enter the number of points in your waveform. From the Edit menu, you can insert a variety of waveforms, sine, square, triangle, sawtooth, pulse, sync, noise, exponential. All of these are also available from the toolbar for a quick insert. For this example, let's insert a sine wave. Here you will specify all of the parameters of your waveform. Insertion point indicates where you will insert the waveform. You can insert it before or after a specific point, or if you have selected a range of points, you can replace the selection with the new points or insert them before or after the selection. Additionally, you can also specify the number of points per cycle, number of cycles, amplitude, and DC offset of your waveform. Once you've entered in all of your waveform parameters, click OK to insert. Click Fit to scale the entire waveform to the window. To add more points, click Edit and then Insert Points. Insert your values and then click OK. To delete points, click Edit, then Delete Points. Select the points you wish to delete, then click OK. Click the Grid button to toggle the grid. To show every point of your waveform, you can click the Dots button. There are three different tools in this window that will allow you to edit your waveform. Edit enables you to rearrange each point. Zooming and panning to an area can help you shape your waveform. Panning and zooming can also be done quickly with a right mouse click and the scroll wheel. The draw button allows the user to draw endpoints by freehand. For straight lines, you can use line. Remember, you can always hit undo if you make a mistake. Once you've finished creating your waveform, click File, then Save. 